Hi friends, today we'll be sharing a video about coconut jaggery making and this method of making jaggery has been passed down by generations. So let's enjoy this video and see how it goes. So as you can see the farmer prepares the inflorescence and cuts the end part and this is where the sap comes out, the juice part comes out. So you collect this juice and if you put it more than like 2-3 days it will turn into alcohol. So this juice is actually used for making jaggery. So sugarcane jaggery is totally different from coconut jaggery. So as you can see our coconut jaggery contains high levels of magnesium and iron compared to sugarcane jaggery. Today he has collected more than 40 liters of coconut juice. So let's get to the process. For removing the impurities of sugarcane jaggery, they mostly use lime and other chemicals. But here, for the purification of coconut jaggery, we only use corals. They call it jelly here in this part of the world. So just after boiling it for more than two hours, you can see that the liquid has evaporated and become a bit more thicker. As you can see, now it has been reduced to really thick, thick sugary paste. And this sugary paste costs about 1000 rupees per kg. So after boiling the 14 liters of juice for more than two hours, we only got about 1.5 kgs of coconut jaggery. So friends, as you can see that the coconut jaggery has been completed and it looks uh, like a thick liquid, not like a normal uh, sugarcane jaggery. But if anybody is interested in buying this and trying this out, which really tastes good and tastes really like caramel, uh, please you can find the numbers in the description and uh, you can contact them and they will send you some uh, jaggery. So I hope you like our video. Please continue to watch our videos and stay subscribed. Please like our videos if you like them. Thank you for watching and have an awesome day. Thank you.